Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Julia Thatcher. And I'm Jeff Hearn. And despite a sunny afternoon, roads and highways remain challenging for drivers after the weekend's winter storm. And we want to give you a look at the road conditions map from Can Drive. You'll see red is uh, closed, purple shows completely covered, and blue is partially covered. We'll see if you, we can get you a look at that map shortly. And we do have live team coverage tonight of road conditions across the entire area. KSN meteorologist Lucy Dahl is in Storm Tracker 3 out checking the roads right now. But we begin first with Zena Taher live in West Wichita. Zena, KDOT crews are using beet juice instead of salt brine in some spots. Yeah, guys, they've been using this beet brine mixture since last night. I'm told that's when they switched over from a brine mixture. If you're on the roads and you see some yellow orange snow, that is probably that beet juice mixture. Take a look. Earlier today, I ran by and caught one of those K dot snow plows filling up. First, filling most of its tank with salt brine, then adding some beet mixture on top of that. This is what it looks like when it's releasing that mixture. K dot says there's a lot of benefits to that pungent mix. Based on the concentration of beet juice uh, mixed with uh, mixed with brine, it can help control. Uh, ice when it gets cold, uh, mostly around like zero degrees. Uh, uh, it also allows the, uh, the, the brine and the salt to adhere to the pavement longer. That gives crews more time to plow. KDOT is using this mix in locations across the state. Here for you, Zena Taher, KSN News 3.